Welcome back to another episode of Explaining Things. Once again, I have a guest who's going to do his best to explain a concept that we're all familiar with but don't necessarily know how it works. Uh, we're done with the raffle bucket. We didn't need that. We're evolving over here. Uh, I have an envelope addressed mm -hmm. to him with a topic inside, a sealed envelope. Mm -hmm. And uh, by the way, this is my guest, uh, New York comedian, Alan Fitzgerald. New York, baby. The moment of truth. Bake a cake. Do you know how to bake a cake? I've never baked a cake. I have never baked a cake, but I've been around a mother who baked a cake. I've seen a grandmother bake a cake. Would you have any idea where to start? If you had no instructions and you had to bake a no. cake. No. No idea. No idea. I mean, I, all right, eggs and flour. Eggs and flour. And frosting. Frosting's an ingredient. <laughs> I didn't tell you what kind of cake. This could be a bunt cake. A bunt cake? <laughs> if I'm making a bunt cake for someone, it's only because I want them to know I don't consider them a friend. <laughs> I made you a bunt cake. Why? You know why. Yeah. But I mean, it's uh, it's flour. There, There's an egg beater, so you know there's an egg. I think there's some milk involved. Probably. Sugar for sure. Sugar. That's a big one. Frosting's got that covered, though. Yeah, but not for the actual cake. The cake is sweet. If there's no frosting on it, it's still sweet. Put a bunch of frosting where the sugar was and it would melt and turn into the damn same thing. Do frosting into the actual batter of yeah. the cake? Yeah, why not? Yeah. You cook the frosting and put the cake on top of it. It's like a reverse. An upside down cake. Yeah. Which is a thing too. A fruit cake. That's also a thing. Is, is it? I've got one right next to me. <laughs> Keep your things separate. You don't need fruit in a cake, okay? Cheesecake has no cheese. It has cream cheese. So I'm wrong? <laughs> <laughs> cheese is good with everything. Cheese is pretty good. Cheese is probably if I had one desert island food. If you were on a desert island, it's just you me. would request nothing but cheese just, to eat. It's just me with like, <laughs> just melted cheese on a beach. I'm eating sandy <laughs> globs of cheese. You need an oven. You need a mixing bowl. Obviously. You, you, yes. need a, you need a whisk or an egg beater. Butter. I think butter's in there. I think butter is in there. Right now, we're just making French toast. There's more to it. Baking powder? That's a possibility. I'm sure there's a little bit. We don't look up the answers after this, guys, so we're never going to know. This is just as good as we can do. Yeah. I'm not a cake guy. I know you're not a cake guy. Not. Surprising. But I know. you're I'm not. not I gave him guy. a cake once. He turned it down. It was the most offended I've ever been. <laughs> it was worse than if someone gave me a bunk cake. If you actually put the right ratios of all the shit together in a bowl and you made it and you had something, how long do you think you'd put it in the oven? You know, 375 degrees it sounds always good. And yeah. I, you're supposed to put a cake in the... It's got to be hours. I don't think you do a one-hour cake. I think it's going to be burnt to shit. All right. 375 for, I'm going to say... 30 minutes. 30 minutes? Maybe I'll have something go across the screen saying what it should actually be. Just in case someone's like, God damn it, I need to bake a cake. This is the only video I this can is find. The, this is the only video I can only find. can't find any recipe websites. <laughs> All I have are these two morons. <laughs> a ruining Classics with Jonathan Tilson and Alan Fitzgerald. It's a hit. I can feel it. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't think it's going to get better than that. Alan Fitzgerald. Jonathan New Tilson. York comic. New York. Thanks for coming. Until New next time. New York.